Hallelujah! My time has come to pray the Lord with my friend listening and watching my program. Thank you, Lord. Give me glory. Hallelujah! We always look at Jesus Christ, whom we love. You know, ah, that is a good time. We are enjoying together the worshiping to the Lord. Hallelujah! Looking to Jesus, the who the going to bless it, his and so all problems you have. Eh? Our goal uh, in our life is uh, to pleasing to God and uh, the worship the Lord in every day that, that which God God has made. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Oh, uh, I want to be like Christ Jesus. I want to imitate Christ Jesus. Day by day, I want to grow to the Jesus that I believe that I can overcome this world. I can uh, live a victorious life within Jesus Christ, the only way I gotta do. The Bible says your attitude should be the same as that of Jesus Christ. <clears throat> Philippians 2 chapter 5. Oh, thank you, Lord. Thank you, thank you. I give you glory. Let's pray together. Give you the God gonna give you strength, the power. Huh? You never be tired. You will be renewed as a wing of the eagle. You can even you walk, you learn. You never tired. Walk is not faint. Isaiah 40, chapter 31. Uh, God will give you the strength we need day by day that we can go to Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord. God is going to reveal the, the vision. God is going to show up the, uh, uh, in the plan what you have to do. Yes, this is a very, very day. In the last days that the devil is going to devour to the believers. Uh, we have to we have to look at the Jesus, looking to Jesus, the who going to lead us and guide us, to protect us. Only Jesus we we can trust him. No other God. No other thing. We can do nothing in the, to live in Jesus in this life. And Hebrews 12, chapter 2 says, the, Let us fix our eyes on earth. Your eyes should be fixed on the Jesus Christ. He is also and the perfect, perfect of our faith. Face, who for the joy set before him endured the cross, scorning his shame, and sat down at the right hand the throne of God. Uh -huh. oh. He just said, he's looking down, sitting right hand the throne of the God. A race of the runner must run toward the finish line. If he does not reach the finish line, he is disqualified this game, athletic game. He must make a goal to reach the finish line if he got the Medal, gold, silver, bronze, whatever you want to get, you must learn and the best effort. Hallelujah. Oh, my Lord. We 
Like this, we should uh, learn until we reach that goal. That goal. The first priority of our life should be given to Jesus. Uh, the only goal of our life should be Jesus Christ. We should uh, look unto the Lord in order to live victorious life and to overcome all our troubles in this life. No other way. We, we sh should look to Jesus. We should fix our eyes on Jesus Christ and concentrate on him. No matter what kind of problem or hardness you may have, we should march forward with the face fixing our eyes on the Lord. If we do that, he will pour out the wonderful grace, the, the blessing to you in life and uh, give a peace to your heart. Wonderful peace you can enjoy. Apostle Paul confessed in Philippians 2, uh, the 3 chapter 14, I press on toward the goal to win, to win the prize for uh, which God had called me heavenward in our Lord Jesus Christ. In this way we have to follow it nothing problem to live in this life. We'll be winner always. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Matthew 14, chapter 22. Yeah. Uh, the, uh, I want to tell you the, 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 uh, the, what, what uh, the Jesus Christ had performed to disciples, especially Peter. While the disciples were Afraid after being met uh, by violent waves on the water in Galilee Lake. You know, Jesus had performed uh, and the uh, miracle that the 5,000 people were fed by uh, two, the five bread and two fish. Then Jesus Christ came to the other side and he had prayed alone in a remote place after he let the disciples went down to the world in Lake of Galilee. So, it was uh, stormy days. The byron the wind came to the water. So they what they were afraid that that time Jesus came to to disciples by walking on the water. The, they were terrified. They were surprised. The seeing the Jesus coming to the world, hmm? walking the world. They, they thought that Jesus was a ghost. But Peter asked, Lord, if it is you come to me 
to you on the world. She just said, come to me. Peter got down out of the boat to walk on the water and walk toward to him. Jesus, but when he saw the, the winds and started afraid, he began to sink the water. When Peter focused on Jesus, he could walk on the water. On the other hand, <clears throat> when he saw the circumstance, the storm, the violent wind, and uh, he was seized with fear. He began to think what I'm telling you. Like a Peter, if we look at the environment around us when we are living in this world, when we encounter the problem, the hardship, difficult problem, and troubles, we don't want to meet such a like a storm. Yes. What do we have to do? Look, have to look at the Jesus Christ to fix our eye to the Jesus Christ. Don't look at the, at the other side. Don't look at the people. We are crossing the sea of sin against the wave of suffering. We are walking in the crossing, the sea of sins, this devil world. When we focus on Jesus Christ only, we can walk on the water of suffering in this world. However, if you look at the problem or the waves which it overwhelmed around us in our life, will fail, will begin to sink. We cannot be succeed. We can make a goal in our life. Jesus gave assignment to do in this life well, until we go to heaven. Therefore, never look at the problem. God is bigger than problem you have now. God is a great cheese. More than your disease, your suffering, your pain. God is God is protect. God is your your deliverance that come out from all the disease and the suffering, the pain, the problem. Hallelujah. Oh, do not look at the people who criticize you, talking to you the bad, with the bad word. You don't want to hear that word. Do not look at the situation you are in. Much for the while fixing your eyes upon the Jesus Christ. 
Oh, my Lord, my, my God, hallelujah, pray the Lord, amen. The purpose of our life is to give glory to God. Isaiah 43, chapter 7 says, Everyone who is called by my name, whom I create for my glory, uh, whom I formed and made, <clears throat> we were created to give to glory. We make money for the glory of God. We study for the glory of God. We are working and task and we're doing our job. Why we do we are doing such it in the in this life? For the glory of God. Hmm? Only one purpose we are doing now is for the glory of God. Hallelujah. We must exalt God and uh, try to change the, this world, yet, yes, you can be changed this world with the heart of Jesus Christ. Ephesians 2, chapter 10, <coughs> we, for you are, you are, oh, what is that? You are, it, it, God, 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 what is that? God, you are God, God made you, yes. Creating Jesus Christ to do for good works, which uh, he prepared in advance to do for good works. Yeah, you are his workmanship. His workmanship. We are his workmanship. Hallelujah. Oh, my life, my life. Ah, thank you, Lord. Our Christian life is not 100 meters the, ra the race. But of them, just like a marathon. Wrong way to go. To win and finish this game. We must endure the long race and finish it. Even though troubles or the hardship may come, we should not Give up. Don't, do, don't give up. In the middle of the race. Galatians 6, uh, chapter 9. Ah. The. Do not give up. If at, if are doing good work in doing for God's work, at for at the proper time, God, you no, you will reap a harvest. If you do not give up, eh? yeah, you can you can get harvest. You can get what you want if you do not give up. Many forefathers of faith are cheering for us now. God is watching us from the heaven, yes. God is looking down what you are doing now. Oh, thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Pray the Lord. Give him glory. I want to I wanna tell you the, the guy who never gave up and, and did his best in his game. Michael Phillip, 
You know, the, everybody, American people know the Michael Phillip, a famous American swimmer who holds the all time record for Olympic medal. Phillip parents divorced and so he caused to him some insecurity in Michael's mentality. When Phillip was in the sixth grade, he was officially diagnosed uh, with the uh, attention deficit uh, hyperactivity disorder. This uh, name of disease is a mental disease. Fairly mothers wanted to provide him with an outlet for his energy by uh, teaching him how to swim. Swim. Philip was chosen to go to Sydney Olympic as a representative player at the age of 14. Hmm? But he did not win a medal. However, he did not give up. Sometime afterward, listen, my friend, you know the, the Michael Failure. He won a total of 18 Olympic gold medal. 18. America history. It is nobody ever make such a like uh, record any rhythm in Olympic game. Eighteen total of eighteen Olympic gold medal in three different Olympic game. making him the winner of all the records. Mm. Yes, because he did not give up. He is my grandson's hero. My grandson is, uh, is, is a swimmer. Yes, he loves swimming. Oh, I, 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 I have time, my time to, just uh, five minutes left. I, I can tell you more to, uh, to introduce another girl who you will see now. A French shooter, Veronica Giredate, was blinded in one I by cancer from the age of two. She was blind two years old. She competed in the Olympic while shooting with one eye, just one eye. She used to do compete the shooting game to another people. Veronica said, shooting is more concentration than vision. My deceased father led me to shooting. He already gave me confidence and the strength that I could do this shooting. I try to hit each target 
as best as I could. As if my father was watching me. Oh, that's a wonderful girl. Yes. Our spiritual father, your father, my father, spiritual father is looking down, watching us and encouraging us. And, uh, you know, to endure with patience. Yeah, we need patience. Romans 5, chapter 3 to 4. So, not only so, but also we enjoy suffering. Because I know that suffering produces uh, perseverance. Perseverance character. Huh? Character. Hope, hope that we long for this hope to see Jesus Christ in that day. Yes, that's our hope, our goal. And we want to, to, to receive the reward God has prepared for us. Uh, uh, this, this is uh, 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 I want to uh, I want to speak more one, one more scripture before I close in this sermon 2 Timothy 4 chapter 7 through the 8 I have fought the good fight I have finished the race finished the race just Paul said Paul confessed, I have kept the faith. Now there is a store for me. The crown of righteousness, which is the Lord who the righteous judge will owe to me on that day, that day. And not only to me, but also those who longed for appearing. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Pray the Lord. Oh, hallelujah. Yes. We all were looking to the Jesus Christ. That Jesus Christ will bless you and protect all your ways that you are going in this life. Fix on the Jesus Christ by your eyes. Thank you, Lord. That is our privilege God gave to you. Thank you, Lord. Pray the Lord. Give me glory. Bye-bye. Next week, see you later.